Hi, I'm Sangita Patel. Now time for your active weather. Let's look at northeastern Ontario. If you are driving on Highway 11 or Trans-Canada, poor visibility. And that's because there's a lot of snow happening around the eastern part of Lake Superior. Wawa can get up to 30 centimeters by Friday morning. Also, Sault Ste. Marie. There will be snow right across the northern Nickel Belt area, bringing about 10 to 15 centimeters of snow. And that system will start pushing into Quebec by Friday morning. Now looking into the prairies, there's that trough sitting right there, bringing flurries around Edmonton, Calgary, Pincher Creek, Medicine Hat, and also Regina will get some flurries too. In the interior and in the northern part, some flurries, but not major accumulation. Now let's look a little bit into the long-range forecast this evening into the overnight period. There's that low pressure system pushing out. And now this is a system we have to watch for the Maritimes because that could bring winter storms. It could be a mix of precipitation. Halifax, Nova Scotia can get rain. Northern New Brunswick and PEI most likely snow and very cold <laughs> right across uh, the Maritimes and the prairies. That cold temperature, cold Arctic air is pushing in and uh, Manitoba still in uh, wind chill warning and that we'll see if that continues into Saturday. Now that low pressure system pushing into Alberta, most likely snow for Saturday and that system will start pushing towards the state by Sunday. Now if we look right across the country, it looks pretty clear by Sunday and uh, it's just cold right across. Toronto will be hitting about minus 10 and with that wind chill, it's going to feel much colder. Stay tuned for a local forecast and uh, have a great day.